How you doing, guys? Uh, I'm I'm talk I'm gonna be talking about um, webcams in on on Mac computers, uh, Mac OS 10, and um, support for them aren't, isn't very good. I mean, it, it gives basic support usually by the UVC uh, drivers uh, that Apple provides, but um, a lot of times you don't get very fine tuning adjustments, and uh, so. I'm kind of kind of point you to some websites and stuff where you can uh, in this program that actually allows you to uh, do all that and give you all kinds of adjustments. And uh, actually, right here, I'm on Wirecast right now. And just to show you, uh, Wirecast does have some basic support, uh, depending on what third-party program you're using. And I'm kind of kind of going to show you, um, for instance. Um, Right here, it does give you some basic control, saturation, brightness, contrast, contrast, and sharpness. But, you know, that's all it really controls. And sometimes that's not enough um, to get what you need. So I'm going to kind of show you uh, what you can use. And uh, now, I want to say that this actually came from um, Steve Haywood from the Tech Buzz. I'm going to give him all the credit, and I'm going to point to where all the files are located and, and how to um, how they adjust everything. So I'm going to give credit to him because it's not my idea. But the solution is so good, I think it needs to be shared with everybody. So I'm going to give him a shout out and let him know I'm kind of making this video. Um, first, I'm going to show you the program and then um, how you can get it. And it actually comes as two programs. Um, one's kind of like the driver or the files to um, communicate with the camera. I think that's what they said, which is libusb. And then you install that. There's an installer file. And the other one's called uh, UVC Control GUI, which is a graphic interface to control all the controls for the webcam. I guess this in case really only controls one webcam that I know so far. Maybe it will control other ones, which is the Logitech C910. And let me go ahead and open that up for you. And it looks something like this. Uh, actually, looks kind of like a Java type program. I'm not sure what the uh, default uh, is. Now, as you can see at the very top, it doesn't show anything. Then you just uh, click on the get. It takes a couple of seconds, and it should actually show two cameras. One should be my um, eyesight camera, which is displaying now. The other one's the Logitech, and it just shows a 16 because I guess it doesn't recognize the name. And as you can see, I'm kind of washed out, um, yellowish color. And there's actually many different um, uh, things right here. Now, I'm going to try to go in here and attempt to um, fix this. Um, now, some of this you actually have to push Git. Uh, I haven't really used it for very long. And supposedly this one, you can uh, do it manually. It goes from auto to manual. I think that's maybe what that is. And here it shows the default settings. Uh, let me see the minimum, maximum. Uh, minimum is uh, 2800, 6500 max. And then here, let me see if I can uh, get it to adjust. Oh, I think I got it set on the wrong one. Oh, there we go. And then from here, you can adjust many things like white balance and, and so on. And uh, actually, wow. Okay, I was messing with it earlier and I couldn't get it to look just as good as this. Okay, as you can see, it greatly um, fixes a lot of things. Um, so it does cover sharpness, saturation, gain, contrast, brightness, um, white balance. Um, it even goes in far as focus and um, iris and things like that. It's a wonderful program. And let me give a shout out to... Uh, the person that uh, actually made the video, which is um, Steve Haywood from the Tech Buzz. And um, what you got to do is go to their website, thetechbuzz.net, and uh, go to Broadcast Now, episode 19. And uh, you click on that, and it's got um, the uh, Logitech C910 Menu Control app for Mac OS X, and you can get the, download the files from there. And um, also check out his website. He's got um, really a lot of good 
um, videos. Um, plus, he does a live show. Actually, he's doing two live shows now, broadcast now, and uh, the tech debate, I think. So um, shout out to him. Obviously, he's the one that did all this, but I think it's important to share it with everybody um, because, you know, Mac has some issues in several things because usually, obviously, Windows is the most popular, so it usually gets the most support. So Mac, you know, and then Linux last. So uh, go check it out and uh, a way to uh, fix a lot of these problems.